tells me I've been dreaming of someone who was never real. It seems I've changed a thousand ways. I wish I looked the way I feel. Break me. Watching them in study hall, but pretending not to, and Deb, the one with the polka dot glasses, you know, she starts flossing her teeth like she's in her own bathroom or something. Ooh, that's so gross. And then get this, she hands the used up floss to Chelsea, who puts it in her knapsack. What was she going to do, recycle it? <laughs> <laughs> I'm your best friend and everything, but don't go expecting me to even touch your used up floss. And vice versa. Calculate fractions to the third decimal place when this mess is cluttering my brain. Hey, relax. How can you live like this? It's chaos. I don't know. It never really bothered me. Plus, I'm hardly ever in here. Okay, first things first. Clothes in closet. With just a little effort, we can even color coordinate. Mm-hmm. Okay, now we need to make piles. Homework here. Letters here. Magazines here. <clears throat> You're not getting all alphabetical on me, are you? No, but books on shelves? Wow. You keep a journal? My mother would love you. Remember when I wrecked my knee when I was rock climbing? Who can forget? I couldn't get out of bed for a week. I went through an introspective stage, wrote it all down. Did it help? Help me realize I'm not the journal type. All I ended up doing was making lists. Can I see? No way, journals are private. Okay, okay. Maria, come get your stuff out of the laundry. Be right back. Introspective stage. Right. What's so private about a bunch of lists? What? Every bone in my body was telling me not to, but still I did. Temptation washed over me like a tsunami. Five things that really bug me about her. One, fix her ways the right way. Two, selfish. Three, know it all, especially in drama. Four, boy crazy. Five, complete sports wimp. I couldn't believe what I saw. No wonder she didn't want me reading her journal. I wasn't all those things she said. I couldn't possibly be, or was I? How could Maria think this stuff about me? More mess <gasps> coming in. Maybe being messy suits you. Being neat isn't the only way. What are you doing? I couldn't exactly tell her that I read her diary. Going home. I have to make sure that the plants are getting enough sunlight. But it's raining out. I couldn't get those words out of my head. I mean, I knew I wasn't perfect, but Maria thought I was so flawed. I thought triathlon meant running, biking, and swimming. It does, but it's raining outside. This is my indoor routine. Can't you play something else for a change? A little funk? Hip-hop? Something? You'll never understand the subtleties of Chopin! Ooh. 
I'm not worthy, you guys. Adam, watch out! Ow! Ah. Hey! What are you doing? That's mine. Take it off. Come on. Mine's broken. Can I borrow yours for my workout? Of course yours is broken. Look how you're treating mine. But it really helps when I train with music. Sorry! You sure can be selfish. There it was. Number two on Maria's dreaded list. Did Adam have a list too? Was this some sort of conspiracy? Thanks a lot. Sharon, Maria's on the phone. Tell her I can't talk. I'm too busy being selfish. Hey, I said it first. Sorry, Maria. We've got sibling rivalry. We've got self-evaluation. She'll have to call you back. So yummy. I just love clean, bright detergent. It makes all my clothes Smells so good, I could eat them. Oh, please. She was an extra in a laundry commercial when she was six. Did you bring Alice in Wonderland? Of course. Cool, okay. I've totally got the best idea. I started choreographing last night. Without me? I, I tried calling, but you never called me back. Watch, we should do a hip hop interpretation. What? falling down the hole. <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> Dancing is not the way to go. Too much movement. We should both be Alice and mime different parts of the story. Watch. Alice taking the pill and shrinking. But that's so lame. Do you have any idea what you look like hip-hopping? <laughs> oh, yeah? You should have seen your mime attempt. Wait, you haven't even seen anything yet. This is Alice falling down the hole. This might make me sound like a know-it-all, but it was obvious no one in that class knew a thing about great performance art. Especially Maria. <laughs> was she laughing at me? Nice moves. Connor, we're close, right? Yeah. Do I bug you? Uh, only when you get boy crazy. You think I'm boy crazy? Well, Alden crazy. I can't believe this. I have to tell you something, but you have to promise to keep it between us. Okay. Something terrible happened yesterday. I opened Maria's diary by mistake. I swear I didn't mean to. We were in her room and my braces did this thing. Well, I don't know what it was, but the next thing I knew, the diary was open and I had nowhere else to look. So I glanced at the page and there was this list because, you know, she's into lists and it was about me and all the things that bug her about me. Wow. This is big. Well, she's not perfect either. She, she can't dance and she's a total slob. And you should talk to her about all this. And tell her I read her diary? Forget it. You'd better not open your mouth either. Never. Zip. an aggressive player like Maria. And I didn't have all the right moves like Maria. That didn't necessarily make me a sports swim. Ow! Sharon! Get it! Ah! <laughs> oh, oh, yes! <laughs> Game over! Man! What was that? 
Sorry. Don't you know the number one rule? Keep your eye on the ball. Okay, okay, I screwed up. Sorry, it's only a game. Games are important to me. Some people aren't as good in sports as other people. That much is clear. Whatever. I don't know what's wrong with Sharon, but she's acting like she's missed all that. Don't say anything, don't say anything, don't say anything. You should have seen her on the field. Too high and mighty to put an effort into winning a game. Is it too much to ask to keep your eye on the ball? I can't say anything to her lately without her acting all weird. What? Sharon read your diary. Excuse me? Tell me I didn't say that out loud. You did. Now you have to tell me what you mean. I, I, I think you should talk to Sharon yourself. I can't believe this. You think you know your best friend and then wham, <gasps> something like this happens. You didn't hear it from me. Of course I heard it from you, Connor. Shoot. Gross. Sharon, you read my diary. Do you even realize what an invasion of privacy that is? It's not what you committed the most immoral of immoral acts. Maria, let me... Explain? What can you possibly explain? The facts are the facts. Best friends aren't supposed to do that, Sharon. Yeah, what do you know about being a best friend? Laughing at me in drama? Yelling at me during field hockey? What's with you? You're driving me crazy. Yeah? Am I bugging you? I've heard I'm good at that. Great. Then why should we even bother being friends? Exactly. Fine. Fine! It's just... It's just so unbelievable that she could do what she did to me. It almost makes me sick. I know. And you know what else I know? I don't need Maria Wong. I can have total fun without her and finally do things I never had time to do when she's around. Like, bond with my family. And then the ball hit me in the leg and she was mad at me. Oops, I'm afraid our time's up. Mom, this isn't a session. Your lasagna's ready. Right, sorry. This is great! I'm glad you could make time for me in your busy training schedule. I said you could time me, not spend time with me. Do you mind? You're sitting <sighs> so close, it's giving me a wedgie. Hmm. Checkmate. But we've only been playing for five minutes. <clears throat> okay, so maybe bonding with my family wasn't as much fun as hanging out with Maria. But there were other girlfriends out there, for sure. Nina says that Frosted is the best because it has a non-threatening shimmer. But of course, you're still at the cuticle repair stage. What was I thinking? Allison was Nina's best friend. I wasn't that desperate. Or was I? I thought there was no hope. Uh, I'm coming! She's calling for me. But... Trust me. I'll be there in a minute. Bye. We're training together for the triathlon. Cool. Can I come? Triathlon, Sharon. Yeah, I heard ya. You know how intense that kind of race is? I like intense. Your definition of intense is when the mall's closing and you only have five minutes to buy new shoes. I'm gonna meet Maria at the pool. See you later. Oh yeah, well you try being between a size seven and a seven and a half. <sighs> and then it was official. Life without Maria just wasn't gonna work. But I bugged her. 
How was I to unbug her? Improvisation. Anybody want to take a stab at showing us what it is? Yes, Sharon. And there I was again, the drama know-it-all. If I was going to make a change, now was the time. Oh, actually, I don't know. <sighs> Nina? Mmm, that smells so yummy. I just love clean, bright detergent. It makes all my clothes smell so good, I could eat them. That's what I would have said on my commercial if they'd asked me to improvise. Thank you, Nina. Hey, Sharon, can I borrow your history notes from today? Yes. Uh, actually, no. You'll never be able to read my writing. I can't even read my own writing sometimes. Oh, um, well, maybe we can hook up after school to go over them. Together? Sorry, Alden. I've got other plans. Oh. Now that was hard. It was obvious that my unbugging plan wasn't working. Now is the time for drastic measures, for something brilliant, something completely out of character. Ninety-six, ninety-seven, ninety-eight. How you doing, Maria? Oh, look, what a bummer. There's some kind of shadow blocking out the sun. Don't tell me the two musketeers aren't getting along. Well, good luck to us all. What are you doing? Competing in a triathlon, how about you? Don't make me laugh. It'll mess up my focus. <laughs> Better for me, then. Racers, take, take your, your positions. positions. On, On your marks, marks get, get set, set, go! Looks as though everyone's putting their medal to the pedal with number 54 in the lead. We're at the final lap of the race with number 54 still in the lead and 41 trailing right behind. Runners. I'd like to call your attention to the lone biker, number 86. It looks like she's taking a shortcut. She's heading your way. I urge you to steer clear. Maria? I'm so sorry. Are you okay? Oh, I think I busted my knee again. Oh, no. Are you okay? Yeah, just a couple of scrapes. Well, I'm out of the race. No way. You've been training hard for this. You're not quitting now. Let's go. This is my pace anyway. Thanks. No problem. This helps. So, I guess you were right. I am all those things on your list. 
What list? I'm so sorry. I know I shouldn't have. I invaded your privacy and I'll have to live with that. It's just, I had no idea I bugged you so much. I'm trying to change, but it's really, really hard. Are you talking about the boy crazy sports wimp list? And selfish, know-it-all, think my way is the right way one. That was about Nina. What? Of course. Oh. So there aren't five things that bug you about me? The only thing that bugs me is that you read my diary in the first place, even after I asked you not to. The lock, it broke, and my braces, well... I guess I just wanted to know what you think about. You're my best friend. I tell you everything. You're right. <laughs> okay, so Maria didn't write those things about me. And even when I thought she did, I eventually wanted her back anyway. Relationships are complicated. It's not like the sixth grade anymore, where you change your best friend every week because they have greasy hair or something. Now we have to work things out and cross the finish line together. <laughs> <laughs>